In this video, we'll look at how to configure the client portal. By going into the administration section and selecting on portal configuration, that will bring us to the options. And the configuration is split into four different sections, general, appearance, features, and portal messages. On the general tab, we have the ability to turn on or off the client portal completely and instructions on how to have your clients access the client portal as well as how to embed the link to the client portal in your own website. If your client goes to simply portal.claimwizard.com they will be prompted for your company code and your company code is found here as well as on your account summary page. If however you link from your website using this URL Claim Wizard will automatically know what company that client is associated with, and the client code or the company code will not be necessary. On the Appearance tab, you have the ability to change your company name as it will appear in the portal, as well as being able to select different colors and changing the general color appearance of the portal itself. This is great because this allows you to customize it so that the client portal matches your company's own colors and branding. On the Features tab, you have the ability to turn on and off different boxes or sections of information in the client portal. Now the loss address and general claim summary information will always appear, but you can turn on and off the claim phase history and settlement history. And we'll be adding additional options here for you. You can also control whether or not the client can upload files. When your client uploads files to their claim, it will appear in a special folder in the Files section of that claim labeled Files Uploaded by Policyholder. This will allow your clients the freedom to upload copies of receipts and pictures and you know, maybe a, a scan of their policy deck page without having those files end up in random folders. You then have the ability to go into that folder of files that have been uploaded by the policyholder and review them, move them to other folders to suit your own organization, and of course remove them. Clients can only upload files. They are not able to see the other files that have been uploaded. Portal messages allow you to customize the different uh, status messages that are displayed to the client and explaining to them uh, how their policy has progressed through the settlement phase. So all the different claim phases that Claim Wizard uses internally, you have the ability to change its name as well as to change the description of what that phase means. This allows you to basically customize the client portal so that it uses the same language that your client would receive if they had called up and spoken to somebody at your company directly. I hope that this video has been helpful to you and be sure to look for other videos.